Hello everyone, my name is Louise Roberts and I'm a senior lecturer in social work at Cardiff University and I'm also part of Cascade which is the Children's Social Care Research and Development Centre. I'm really pleased to be introducing this conference series, It Takes a Village, Global Perspectives About Care Experience Parents. The conference is being hosted in partnership between Exchange Wales and INTRAC, the International Research Network on Transitions to Adulthood from Care. For those of you who don't know, the purpose of INTRAC is to promote national and international research on the transition to care from care to adulthood. And if you would like to find out more, please visit globalintrac.com. Similarly, for those of you who are new to Exchange Wales, we are a forum which brings together researchers, practitioners, policymakers, and experts by experience to share expertise. And through our events, we hope to support developments and improvements in social care and social work practice. Exchange Wales is funded by the Welsh Government through Health and Care Research Wales, and Exchange Wales sits within Cascade at Cardiff University. So I thought it would be helpful to provide a bit of background uh, to this conference series. And in 2021, Tahila Rafeli from Ben Gurion University of the Negev in Israel and I established a thematic interest group within INTRAC and we hoped to bring together researchers with shared interest in parenthood um, for young people and adults with care experience. We started as a really small but committed group and we have steadily been growing and making new connections. And our success as a group influenced our decision to host this conference series. So we wanted to share the range of work that has and is being conducted uh, in this area and to make it as accessible uh, as possible and to a widen audience as possible. The conference series allows us to work across different time zones. Uh, the majority of presentations are recorded and can be accessed uh, as and when is convenient. And we also have two live sessions, one involving colleagues in the US and another with colleagues in Australia. Importantly, uh, all of the sessions and the resources will remain available after the duration of the conference. We have a great programme planned. Please have a look at the list of abstracts for more details about the individual presentations. But we have tried to organise the series to start with an overview of the evidence base and its development and progression in the US. So that is the focus of the opening live session with Svetlana Spiegel, Elizabeth Aparicio and Amy Dworsky. Then we have um, a series of presentations presenting findings related to parents' experiences across a range of different contexts. Our second live session then uh, featuring Amy Gill and Jade Patel focuses on some important and cross-cutting issues for care experience parents, namely housing and professional responses. And then for the final part of the series, we will move to consider opportunities for strengthening support and encouraging positive change. Again, we have some recorded presentations related to that, but we will also launch a new resources page on the Exchange Wales website, featuring work by Bernardo's in England. So Bernardo's is a third sector organisation, and they've recently conducted a peer research uh, project with care experience parents. I wanted to mention the contribution of parents in the planning and delivery of the conference series. So in the planning uh, stages, members of the group sought to consult with parents uh, that we were connected to and asked for comments and input about our initial plans. As part of that, we asked for suggestions on the title of the conference and it takes a village seemed uh, to be a phrase that resonated uh, across different uh, contexts. It was a recurrent recommendation and, and that is why we've adopted it. 
Parents uh, are also contributing to the conference by sharing their work or and or experience. That includes being leading or being part of some of the presentations, but we've also received several blogs from parents, which we will be releasing over the coming weeks. Just before I finish, I wanted to highlight that we will be providing a forum for uh, people to interact um, throughout the conference. So we will have a Padlet available uh, and we would really encourage you to submit any comments or questions about any of the presentations um, as we as we go through that we will be monitoring and, and responding to it. Um, so we hope that that will generate some really important, valuable discussion. Uh, and it's designed to sort of overcome some of the issues with recorded presentations, you know, which don't offer the opportunity for some questions at the end. So we'd really encourage you to engage with the Padlet, please. And then just before I go, I wanted to say a huge thank you uh, to everybody that's been involved in setting up and organising this conference. I know how busy everybody is um, and I really appreciate how much everybody has pulled together to make this happen. Uh, we've all been really committed to, to sharing this important work. I have to say a special thank you to the Exchange Wales team, Sean, Dan, Luke, Tom and Sam, uh, who've done an amazing job in the organisation and the presentation. Um, genuinely, we could not have done it without you, so, so thank you. And now all that remains for me to say is that I really hope that you enjoy the series. Thank you very much. <laughs>